Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Okay, so for today, I would like to share with all of you one of my favorite book. Okay, this is my favorite book, and the title of this book is uh, "In Love with Science." Okay, although I'm I'm not a science teacher. Okay, so I think uh, when I read this book, it has been uh, it has uh, provided me uh, with the knowledge to share my understandings of science uh, to my kids and also how uh, I can uh, build my interest uh, to love science. Okay, this book is written by Sukat Sukuna Pachiapan. Okay, she is a teacher, and this book is based on her true story and also her experience as a science teacher. So as you can see on the um, from the cover page here, okay, it's stated here. This is a simple guidebook to encourage pupils to change their mindset positively and love to explore science. So I shared this book with my kids. Okay, their perceptions after they read this book, I, I can see that uh, they love science and they know about science and also they can they they know about uh, who is the expert okay the science experts so this book is published uh, by um published by the inspiration hub okay this is the publisher it consists of how many pages let me see okay it consists of 110 pages but it also consists of uh, infographic okay infographic like this and then the, at the end of each chapter it has its own bibliography so when you read this book, okay, you can feel that uh, you have the interest um, to understand more about uh, science. It consists of three chapters. Chapter number one is the heroes in science. Chapter number two is about how to cultivate interest in science. So this is very important. How you can build your interest uh, to love science. And chapter three is about how to score high marks in science. So this is a favorite one for my uh, uh, daughters because when uh, she read uh, this chapter, how to score high marks in science, I can see uh, she is um, improving, okay, um, in terms of uh, her result in science. Also, my favorite chapter is in chapter one because as you can see here, the heroes in science. So for those who are not uh, really, you know, uh, familiar about uh, who is the science expert, so they can know about uh, their background, their invention, and also their achievement. For example, like for this one uh, about the Newton. Okay, so this is a picture of the Newton. So it consists of all the background about his invention and also his achievement. And um, interesting part is that um, at the end also it shows that. Um, the Isaac Newton quotes. You know, I believe all of you know who is the uh, is Isaac Newton. He's a an expert in science. Okay. So the other uniqueness of this book is that um, not only uh, it has provide word of thoughts uh, in each subsection, but also it has quotes from the famous heroes in science. Especially as you can see um, in page. Um, uh, let me show to all of you in page forty seven. You have not taken. In page 47, okay, you can see here, alright, page uh, 47, okay, uh, you, okay, as a reader, you can write down things that uh, maybe perhaps you want to um, have the idea on how you can invent in future, okay, for those who are really like interested uh, to uh, maybe uh, want to invent anything in, in future so they can write up, okay, they can fill in down things that you would like to invent in future you can put your name my name uh, DOB and what is your uh, invention and uh, for me this is a very uh, interesting book because um, I believe that um, uh, after you read the book, this book you can feel that you have to um, you have the interest in science cultivate your uh, motivations in learning science and also it can uh, motivate our uh, pupils out there uh, to appreciate science and also perhaps um, it also can give an insight uh, for the teachers to be a better uh, educator and uh, maybe initially to the parents okay me as a parent also I will get um, 
a positive perceptions and understanding uh, and to understand science better so it can also uh, motivate my kids to become a successful person in future okay at least maybe they have the idea perhaps they want to uh, invent anything in future so they can read this book and you know the uh, i can see um their perceptions toward um understanding in science is um uh, difference and improve okay so that's all about um uh, this book so i do hope if you want to know more about this book perhaps you can um get this book okay um so i think that's all for me okay bye